Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Toolbox Tuesday. Oh my goodness, it is September the 6th and it is back to school. So I'm sure a lot of you are running around getting things, well, probably dropped off kids by now. But uh, anyways, it is a busy time of the year. So I know many of you will be just watching the replay, but thanks for joining me. Um, I would like to um, say thanks for chiming in and I'm also excited to share about my Masterpiece Magic program which is already half full, super exciting. Program will be launching September 26. It is for kids the ages, or I should say teenagers, the ages of 12 to um, 16 and they will be learning everything from nutrition, uh, photography, art, and tuning in to actually knowing what their masterpiece is and learning about mindset. So if you wanna hear more about that, you can go to my Whole Health Family Wellness um, website. And today's topic is creating our reality. So, um, I guess I want to say that experience has taught me that the words we say can create our reality and not only the words but our thoughts and um, so much has changed for me over the last year um, and I really do believe it's because I've been able to change my thoughts and what I think has changed what has shown up for me in my life. I know I've talked about this many times, how I've sat in my blue chair paralyzed with anxiety, literally waiting for confidence to knock on my front door. And you know, it doesn't happen if we're stuck in the stories of our mind all the time. And so, um, what I want to say is that um, I've changed this by changing my thoughts and this book that I'm reading right now, The Soul of Money, has really cemented everything that I've learned, um, not only learned, um, but put into practice this year. And it's this idea that, you know, we create our reality. And so um, the book, again, um, Lynn Twist, um, she says here, conversation creates the context of life. We think we live in the world. We think we live in a set of circumstances, but we don't. We live in our conversation about the world and our conversation about the circumstances. When we're in a conversation about fear or terror or about revenge and anger and jealousy and envy and comparison, then that is the world we inhabit. But if we're in a conversation about possibilities, a conversation about gratitude and appreciation for the things in front of us, then that's the world that we inhabit. And that is what I have really focused on in this last year. And, you know, so many things have changed for me in this last year. It, it's almost um it's almost hard to believe but just by changing my mindset and being grateful for what i have right now in this moment the things that i've been able to create is incredible i've created my toolbox tuesday which you're here to share with me today i've met a fantastic man named aaron who redid my website for me and it's beautiful I've been able to um, meet so many amazing new like-minded friends. I cannot even express the gratitude and how amazing it is to have that. Um, I've created a Masterpiece Magic program that um, I have partnered with two other people from around the world. I traveled across Canada in a rooftop tent. I did the West Coast Trail. I spent eight days on Williams Beach uh, with four other amazing families. 
and I've written letters um, asking donors to help purchase my retreat center that I will own one day that's just up the street from me. Um, and I've also been able to still find space for myself in and amongst supporting my son with autism who's struggling with and doing fantastic, by the way, an eating disorder and my daughter who also struggles with anxiety. It is truly amazing of the things that we can accomplish when we change, change our mindset to be positive. And I just feel so much gratitude in what has happened over the last year. So I want to share a little tool that I use to help me with this. And a big shout out to my friend Jeannie. Um, it's called How Good Could It Go? So you take your journal or you take a piece of paper and you literally write out at the top, how good could it go? And so, for example, today, um, I could say someone could drop off flowers at my home for me today. Or I could say I could have one or more people donate all the money that I need for my retreat center and have enough money to run it for years to come. Um, I could have a full program for my Masterpiece Magic and enough kids to do the next cohort on a waiting list. Um, I could reach out or somebody could reach out to me about my Toolbox Tuesday and think it's so fantastic that they want to make it global. Um, my kids could have the best school year ever um, with increased confidence and independence and a deep understanding of what it means to love themselves. And so you just keep writing and keep creating your reality over and over and over. So I hope that tool is helpful for you. It has been incredibly helpful for me. Um, again, the changes in my life that have happened in this very short one year um, is a testament to my mindset, my gratitude for what is, and my love for myself, and which then bleeds on to the other people around me. So sending love to you all. Thank you for joining me and um, have a fantastic week. Take care.